useless. Idiot. Such a loser. Weak and pathetic. Oh, what a weirdo. Good, Good for, for nothing. nothing. What a reject. Hey, freak. <laughs> so fake. Loser. loser. Poor little baby. baby. <laughs> Such trash. <laughs> Such a phony. Oh, freak. <laughs> what a waste of space. So gross. What a Oh, go ahead and cry. I am not all of these things. I am not. Why do they keep telling me all of this? Why can't they see me for who I am? I am not all of these things. I am not. I am brave, I am enough. When we understand that the things we say can deeply affect others, we are more motivated to stop bullying in its tracks. By intervening and standing up against bullying, we break the cycle of harm and create a safer, more supportive environment for everyone. It's about fostering empathy and respect ultimately promoting kindness and understanding instead of cruelty and division. Good morning class. Good morning ma'am. I have a special announcement for you all. We have a new student who is joining us today. Can we have you over here Huda? Please introduce yourself to the class. As the 
day comes to a close, the students learn a valuable lesson about empathy and inclusion. By embracing Huda's uniqueness and supporting her journey, they discover the beauty of diversity and the power of compassion. The story reminds us that kindness knows no boundaries and that together we can create a welcoming and inclusive community. You know, that little voice in your head, the one that tells you to ignore a tasteless joke, the one that tells you to keep quiet when a client makes a racist comment, The little voice that tells you you're not smart enough because English isn't your first language. Or that it's okay to judge someone for leaving early because they have family commitments. The one that tells you not to say anything when others are being reduced to stereotypes. Or that it's not a big deal when everyone's opinion isn't considered. You may think you're the only one that hears that voice, but that voice also speaks to other people. It says you're different, you're an outsider, you lack commitment, your opinion doesn't matter. Instead of listening to that little voice, you need to find yours and make it heard. Breaking the boundaries of self-doubt is deeply connected to inclusivity, especially in a classroom setting. Inclusivity involves creating an environment where everyone feels valued and their voices are heard, regardless of their background, abilities and circumstances. Which encourages individuals to overcome self-doubt, which can be particularly important for students with disabilities who may face additional challenges or doubt their own abilities. Empowering individuals to find their voices and make them heard, we can foster a more inclusive and supportive learning environment for all. Arzina, a young woman in her early 20s, sits nervously, scrolling through her social media feed. She hesitates before hovering the accept button on a friend request from her mom, Huda. Should I accept her request? Her girlfriend, Tanya, enters the room, noticing Arzina's dilemma. What's wrong, babe? It's my mom. She sent me a request on Insta and I'm really scared to accept it. So is there something you wanted to hide from her? I told her about us yet and I do not know how she will react after seeing her pictures on Instagram. You don't have to hide anything from her, Arjuna. Your mom loves you the way you are no matter what. Buddha, Arzina's mom, was anxiously waiting for her daughter to accept her request on Instagram. Arzina just accepted my request. What's going on, Mama? Better see, Arzina just accepted my request. Oh, that's great. I'm sure she'll be happy to connect with you now. Yeah. <laughs> Arzina's mom went through her social media and then accepted her for who she is. It's mom. Arzina's eyes well up with tears of relief and joy as she reads her mom's message. Thank you, mom. See, I told you she'd understand. Yes. This story promotes inclusivity by de depicting a young woman's journey of acceptance, both in terms of her identity and her relationship, with the context of her family.
It could be a valuable resource for classroom settings to foster discussions about acceptance, diversity, and LGBTQ plus representation. It portrays themes of love, support, and understanding, which are universally re relatable and important for students to explore. In a world where stereotypes confine and norms dictate, it's time to shatter the glass ceiling and redefine what it means to be a woman. Join us as we showcase the everyday movements where women break free from societal constraints and embrace their true potential. When a woman speaks, the world listens. In corporate setting and beyond, women live an indelible mark with their intellect, insight, and unwavering determination. Gone are those days when driving was considered a man's domain. Today, women take the wheel with confidence, proving that the road to empowerment knows no gender. From boardrooms to kitchen, women are masters of multitasking, juggling responsibilities with grace and resilience. Because a woman's worth is not defined by her role, but by her ability to thrive in every aspect of life. So let's celebrate the women who dare to dream, who challenge the status quo and who pave the way for generations to come. Because when a woman believes in herself, there's nothing she can't achieve. The other children nod in agreement, feeling Tanya's sincerity and understanding the importance of her message. We should treat everyone with kindness, no matter how they are, because everyone is unique in their own way. This indeed portrays inclusive and suitable for a classroom setting. It portrays a positive message of inclusion, acceptance and kindness which are important values to teach children. The story demonstrates how children can overcome stereotypes by embracing diversity and treating others with respect. It's a great way to promote discussions about racism, empathy and the importance of unity in a classroom environment. of breaking boundaries, the character's journey culminates in a powerful realization of the transformative impact of empathy and inclusivity. Through their experiences, they come to understand that true unity is forged by embracing diversity and confronting prejudice head-on. The characters break down societal barriers and challenge stereotypes, showcasing the profound connection that can be formed when individuals look beyond superficial differences. The conclusion resonates with empowering messages about the value of diversity, the importance of standing up against discrimination and the ongoing commitment required to create a more inclusive society. It leaves audience with a sense of hope and inspiration 
reminding us that positive change is achievable when fueled by empathy, understanding and a, col and a collective dedication to justice and equality.